Hello you lovely wonderful people, welcome back to another gameplay today we are playing the Fizz in the Jungle Also with it, AP Fizz, all that lovely damage, all that lovely one shots, it's gonna be a lot of fun guys Ugh, Just like a whole group of mushrooms, lots of fun guys So we're going to uh, start the bot side this game and I suppose I should show you my runes Pretty standard stuff here. I kind of feel like I should uh, mute my team. I'll get to that in a sec. Uh, but we've got the electrocute for standard. Re you know, honestly, this stuff's really self-explanatory. It's standard stuff. It's standard stuff. You just run this stuff, and uh, you'll be you'll be sorted. Right, I'm gonna get a leash from your bot side because, as you would imagine, uh, Fizz is a not the best jungler. Funnily enough. So one of one of Fizz's uh, Fizz's biggest problems is pre six. So before level six, he struggles, uh, and against enemy champions, he's what the flip is this guy doing against enemy champions? Uh, he really is not that good. Did he do red and then just invade me? Yes, he did. I'm not safe on this top side of the map, am I? Let's get this bot crap. We do have this warded for another forty five seconds. Uh, so, uh, like you're seeing here, you can get bullied out by enemy junglers in this early game. Uh, now, Trundle is actually one of these champions who is way stronger in the 1v1 than most. He is coming down here as well, so I'm going to have to smite this. But I should still get it. Never mind. You're welcome for the leash, mate. <laughs> All right, not the best start, but that honestly, the the problem there is that I hesitated. If I'd gone straight to that camp, everything would have been fine. But I, I walked around. I was like, hmm, "What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do?" I should just ran straight to this bot side here, straight to that bot side. But I hesitated. Still, it's whatever, because Fizz Jungle. It doesn't matter. I'm gonna get my level six. I'm gonna run around. I'm gonna be one shotting people. This Trundle is just a nuisance. He ain't gonna stop me. Alright, taking a look at the lane setups here to decide where I want to go and what I want to do in this game. That was awkward. Um, basically, the main one here is before level 6, Akali is pretty weak. I'd like to be able to do stuff in the mid lane just so that uh, I can unlock that Aurelian soul. Anytime you have a Roamer in the mid lane, it's a good idea to try and put some pressure on that lane, both playing with and against that champion. Uh, so, say there's like a TF, for example. If you put pressure on that lane, what will happen? is you will enable them to either get... S if you're playing against them, you'll keep them in that lane, which really helps your team. And if you're playing with them, uh, it will unlock them so that they can roam around and they don't just have to sit in the lane. Because the Aurelian Soul doesn't really want to sit in the lane. He doesn't want to just 1v1 the Sakali. He wants to move around. So if I if I can get some help to him, then uh, you know that's all good stuff. Uh, bot lane, obviously, though, is the m more of a focus from a... Uh, uh, Traditional standpoint where they're just a strong lane, good gank setup, all that lovely business. Rain Souls on his way. I'm also on my way. This could be my ticket to getting a bit more experience here. Level two. That's bloody blooming go, boys. I'm level two because he took me blooming. Ah, <laughs> oh, it's fine. <laughs> so th th this is the thing: is he took my top side. Uh, he took my he took my top side crab, so I couldn't get that. Then he took my bot side crab, so I couldn't get that. And I was just left to flounder about. So yeah, it's not a great start, but it's honestly fine. It is fine. Will be fine. This is why you don't pick. By the way, if you're playing in your ranked games, this is a ranked game, but still, if you're playing your ranked games, uh, you have to be able to play around this early weakness of your of your jungle pick. It sucks right now, but I'm like at a three camp deficit, which is not great, obviously, but it's not the end of the world, and it will be fine. Your AOE clears are actually better than you would think. Look how much healing I'm getting. Because I jumped on the on the camp, and with my medallion, it just gives you a load of healing. It's really good stuff. 
Now this top side crab is uh, probably down already. I'm just going to ping out that Trundle might be around top side. Mention that one. Uh, and then we'll just keep on clearing bars. Now as far as your skill order goes on Fizz Jungle, there's two ways you can look at it. Either you want to get some points in your W to make your clears better. Because it gives you like more on-hit damage, which is really good for clearing the jungle, as you would imagine. Uh, or you want to max your E, because that's kind of standard Fizz. Like, if you're playing Fizz in the lane, you would be maxing your E, right? Because it gives you more burst damage, uh, but also it helps with your wave clear and stuff. Now, you don't have to worry about wave clear on Fizz. Fizz jungle. So, that's one less reason to max E. But if you want burst damage in your ganks, you should be maxing your E, right? So, what I like to do is I put a few points in my W, and then I max E after. So I st I'm not even going to check this because I'm just going to assume it's down. And he started topside as well with his red buff. So there is pretty much no reason why that Skull Crab shouldn't be dead. As you can see, it is dead because now we can see on the minimap that this one is respawning soon. Which means that this topside did die. I would like to get this bot side crab though, but I mean at this point in the game, uh, if you can't 1v1 the enemy jungler, you have to rely on uh, lane pressure to get you scuttle crabs. And uh, my lane pressure is not too bad actually. I would like to get this crab, if possible. Good hook. Beautiful. Alright, good stuff. That helps me out. Good gank, good kill. Good combo. Can we get this crab? Is my question. Oh, we just dinged six. We're diving bot lane. That's a mistake. I feel like we should have gone for this crab here. Yeah, well, obviously it's a mistake because they both just died. Hmm, greed there. Greed. Well, hmm. Okay, that's a shame. I really want to get this level 6, like I'm not particularly useful before I hit 6. As you can see though, if, if I got that crab, um, I'd actually be around the same level as this trundle. Like we, we'd be more or less equal here. Um, so that's, he's got what, f 4 crabs on me right now, which is a huge difference. It's massive. It really sucks. <laughs> really, really sucks. <laughs> but hey. The, honestly, you're asking for it. If you're playing, if you're playing something like this, you are asking for it. You just gotta pray that you have lane priority, that you can play around your team, or your team can play around you. All good stuff. If you guys do enjoy this gameplay, by the way, I know it's a little bit ugly right now, but still, if you do enjoy it, give me that cheeky thumbs up. Subscribe to me as well if you want to see more of these things. More importantly, guys, let me know what you want to see. Drop me a comment. Tell me what champion do you want to see me play in the jungle? Because as you can see, I'm 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 open to things, boys. I'm open to things. All right. I believe this top side crab will be spawning next. Not hundred percent sure. I believe that's what's going down. Ooh, Trundle. Ooh, Akali. I'm actually glad Akali's here because now he can't blame me for that. Oh shit! Trying to get my blue. What a bell. How dare he. <laughs> yeah, I'm sensing a bit of animosity in this bot lane. <laughs> F your mother. Okay. Very nice. This guy's getting an ignore. Oh, I hit it. He's dead, right? Beautiful stuff. Don't think we can get him, though. That's fine. Good stuff. <laughs> I agree. We do have a good jungler. <laughs> I might get my first crab of the game. <gasps> Is it going to happen? Is it going to happen? 
Ooh, Iranian Souls will be bot side. Okay, there goes my priority. But I should still get this. <gasps> we did it! Woo! Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And I get to hold this top lane for free farm. Oh, yes, please. You know what? I'll take the crab, the grunt first. Because Garen will push this in. When he sees Sai and bot side, Garen will hard push this into the, into the minions. Really? He's going to freeze? Okay, that's cheeky. Garen should be pushing this one. He is pushing. Okay, good. He could probably dive me, honestly. He wants to. <laughs> Jesus, Garen. <laughs> Carve your titties, son. I actually can't even stay around. I know it's cheeky, but I genuinely can't. I'm gonna go mid with my ult instead. There's a chance I could outplay Garen, but not really. I mean, he's Garen, right? He's got like zero mechanics as a champion. There's not really much outplaying to be done, you know? So we'll hold mid instead. Beautiful stuff. I really want my runic echoes. I can afford it. Oh shit. a really good interrupt there from the from the lantern. I really saw such a weird champion. Look at this guy. Nice. No fear. No fear. Actually, there is some fear. I definitely fear Trundle. So can we say some fear instead? Can we say that? Also, guys, I have a present for you all because I, I think you guys are great. I love you all. And you deserve to be rewarded for having to sit through this early game. We have a Shad Gun. Shadwell is here. Oh! Just as I put the Shad Cam on. Yeah, I jinxed it. What the hell? Just as I put it on. Holy moly. Are you actually gonna like wake up now, Shadow? Or are you just. Whoops, steady on, doggy. <sighs> Shadow, when his old age has become very uh, right focused. Can I say that? Does that make sense? So. He's always like stumbling around to his right hand side. And it makes him a bit wobbly, doesn't it, Shad? Nice. Beautiful stuff. Beautiful stuff. They won't catch me. Dude, why is everyone being so BM? What's, kind of, what's, what's wrong with people? Let's play, let's play League of Legends, boys. Can I get this crane? Is this crabe up? I would be surprised. I actually, yeah, coin just got it. Thank you, Thresh. very much you're gonna leave Shadwell you're leaving us I think he's I think he's leaving guys I think he's out of here <laughs> Can 
God damn this guy. He has Triforce, like he's he's really it's it's a lot of damage. I I do need to respect him. It's not like I can just He will one combo me, like really, really easily. He's not really my point of worry either. Shadwell. I don't really have to care about Garen. We're not gonna win or lose the game based off of Garen. Fair enough. Shadwell, what are you doing, Dogro? All right, all right, hold on. Right, let me push this wave in, and then we go and put you downstairs. How's that sound, Shaddy? All right, Shad. <sighs> Sorry about that, guys. Right. Let's go. Could go pro belt. I don't like going pro belt personally because it's another thing I have to use my brain for. And I mean, I'm already limited in that department. So why would I, why would I want to make it even harder? Whew. Got my level, got my level 11, which is ranked 2 ulti. Weird time to go some, do something bot side, honestly. Never mind. I thought they just put the Herald down. Which actually would have been good for us, because I could have interrupted with my Shark. Actually, could I interrupt with my Shark? I don't think I would have had the... I think it would have been a bit too... Uh, too slow, you know? Oh my god, I'm not even going to get this. This would have been my second crab, and I'm not even going to be able to get it, am I? Well, at least we get it as a, as a team. Oof. Sorry, I don't need farm boys. I don't need to be strong. Just sit in mid here in case Draven gets in trouble. Yeah, I'm down, I'm down. I'm down. <laughs> oh god, no! Oh my god, he actually just drove by. No, 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 no. Thinking Rodi might come in here, but that's fine. If we we dealt with the Herald, so this is fine. Wait for Draven to come in as well. I'm just sitting down the bot side here because like Blitzcrank isn't dedicating to anything, nor's Quinn, Trundle as well. Like they, if they know I'm around here, they're really scared to make a move like that because they don't want to leave their backside open. So let them go. Easy peasy. We can win a team fight like that. 
Just a threat of me being on the side doing something. It works. Nice. Best to try and land your shark as far as... Like, to get it to travel as far as you can. Obviously, that makes it harder to hit. But uh, the, mo the further it travels, the more damage it does. So, not bad stuff overall there. Top side, it's also hard pushing. Aurelian Soul can pick that one up. Draven... I'd like, I mean, Draven can take the blue buff, but he doesn't seem to care about it. It's been up for a while now. I think he'll, I think he'll get it soon. He'll want it soon. He might go for it now. Just reset, buy, and then come out and get your red. Same for Radiant Soul with the blue buff. Take that one, it's fine. Do we want this? Because they're going for it. Hmm. Don't know if we can stop it. Rip. Noise. Noise. Poor Draven. But hey. We get kills, I don't care about you, Draven. Why am I mid? I mean, we're not going to be pushed this in. I don't have particularly good wave clear or anything like that. I'm just going to stand around in case I'm needed, but... That's fine as well. And tank the hook. I don't. I don't know if that was going to hit my team or not, but hey, it's better it hits me because I can get out really easily since we've already used the lantern, a radiant soul, and thresh can't escape. <laughs> Why are they mocking me? <laughs> Taking the piss out of me. They don't like my fizz. I think my fizz is great. Right, got my Lich Bane here. I need to get Zonis as well. Oof. What? Jesus. No! I just needed one more auto. Almost had it. Almost had it. So close. So close. Next item here, could go for the old Morellos, could go for, uh, so good options here would be Morellos, Void Staff, Death Cap, uh, Zonias, could maybe go Banshees, I mean I already mentioned the Proto Belt, you could still get Proto Belt, I think it's better as like an earlier item, but you could still get it. Uh, I think I'm going to go for the Zonias. I actually really like Zonius on Fizz. Buys you a lot of time, which is important. Your ultimate actually has a pretty low cooldown as well, so it's... I mean, it's unrelated to the Zonius point, I guess. But it's it's cool, it means you can just jump in. You, you can go pretty ballsy and not instantly die, basically. Especially if your team's doing well, like uh, in this game. Because you go in... And your team's able to mop up, you know. It's all good stuff. She's still in that bush. 
Yes, she is. <laughs> that was a cheeky little ward right here. To see that she hadn't left the bush. That was cheeky. Look how much damage I have. Do you, do you honestly though? Do you see that? It's legitimately crazy. It's legitimately crazy. We're not taking good care of our side lane right here. Yeah, I mean we've got mid inhibitor down. We really want this lane to be pushing. Uh, rather than before we set up like this. Because it just means that we're on a timer now. Like, this isn't going to be working in our favor. At some point, we're going to have to recall to go... Oh, my God. At some point, we're going to have to recall to deal with that top wave. Or we'll threaten losing our tower. This is why you have Zonus and Fizz. Alternatively, if we had, if our wave was pushing like this, it would be a ticking time bomb against the enemy team for them to have to go top and deal with it, which makes it a lot easier for us to siege. Anyway, that's how you play Fizz Jungle, boys and girls. I mean, the early game was about as bad as it could have gone. Uh, bad matchup. I mean, Fizz doesn't really have any good matchups, but bad matchup plus, as you would imagine, well, as you'd imagine, bad matchup, but also I didn't play it well because I hesitated right at the beginning, which lost me uh, the. Scott's crab, which really, really sucks. Getting two crabs down really, really sucks. Um, but we recovered because we knew what we had to do to win. And so we won. Yeah. Once you get that level six, guys, you're strong as heck. You're strong as heck. Honestly, Fizzle is just nutty ability. Uh, I'm going to honor... Who do I want to honor... Just on the table. Radiant Soul was a bit mean to me, wasn't he? He was a bit he was a bit mean. Look at all that damage I did. Millions of damage right there. Thanks so much for watching guys. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to me to see more in the future. Most importantly, I will see you in my next.